Wait, 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 stop, 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 stop. What are you doing? We're in July. There's 165 days left for Christmas. Hi everyone, thank you for joining me again. And if you're new to my channel, then a big fat warm welcome to you. I'm currently at 900 subscribers, so I would absolutely love if you can subscribe and help me reach 1000 subscribers by the end of July. So today I am filming a thriftmas challenge. I know, I know, it's a bit early for Christmas in July, but I guess that's what makes it a challenge. And let me tell you, it was definitely a challenge. Shopping for Christmas things here in the UK, it was so, so difficult. I think all of you in the US and Canada, you have like yard sales and garage sales and thrift stores. Here we only pretty much have charity shops and they're really, really small. And it was definitely hard finding any Christmas things in there. So I was just walking everywhere trying to get my hands on some things. Before I forget, this challenge is hosted by Nicole over at Nesting Haven. So let me share what I did find. But first, let me have a sip of this tea. So the first item that I managed to grab are these candle holders and you can definitely tell that this is thrifted because look at how old this box is. So here it is opened up, there's loads of toppers in here, so you've got some miniature Christmas ones like Santa, got a Merry Christmas sign here, a bit of holly and let me just tell you this smells so good. Whatever cake this was on was definitely delicious. <laughs> You've got a little tiny um, shoe here as well. So that's it for my first find. Next I bought this photo frame and it's in a bauble. So I really did like that. Next I've got this and it's a me to you bear and it's got a jumper on with a star so I thought this is really nice for a terrarium. Next I have brought these beautiful beautiful tea light candles in the shape of a Christmas tree. I actually feel too bad to light candles that are this beautiful. Does anyone else have that problem? I just kind of leave these as ornaments, to be honest. And I also managed to find some snowflake sequin things, and this is definitely going to come in handy for my crafts. I also got this decoration gift set. I think it's originally from Morrison's. And what they have in this box here is three wooden stag decorations, three twine, nine present bows, three pom-poms and two tags. Another thing I brought are these gel decoration things. I've never used these before so I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them, if I can somehow craft them or put it in some kind of DIY. I'm not sure otherwise they will probably just be stuck on the window as decoration. <laughs> And next I have this Noel letter sign and I've bought this bauble and it's full of glittery silver stars. I also bought this and I think this is also originally from Morrison's. It's a pack of pom-pom ribbons and garland. Next I bought this really cute penguin. It's got its hat on with a scarf. And the next item I bought is really quite big. Beautiful bears. Again, I think I've got a few bear things this time for Christmas. And I think I'm going to be including these in some sort of DIY. So if you want to see what I do with these things nearer Christmas time, make sure you are subscribed. And this actually has some sort of damage, but it's a bit difficult to see unless you're close up. So something is missing here, but
but I thought that's quite cute. And then I purchased this. Absolutely love small miniature things, so I had to had to get this. And it also lights up, so I'll show you how that looks. Now I'm on my final two, and these are definitely my favourite picks through this whole thriftmas. And this is a beautiful village that turns on and looks absolutely magical so I've got to turn it on and show you all how it looks. It does have a few bits missing, again it is difficult to sort of tell, this has got something missing off here. Why don't you just find scenery like this, miniature scenes and things that just turn on, just so magical. I just can watch this for hours and I just find it so peaceful and calming and relaxing as well. So let me show you my final pick and here he is, isn't he adorable? I just love him. If you've got any names, any suggestions for this guy, let me know in the comments because I can certainly do with some suggestions. I've just never seen anything like this before and I really did get him at a bargain of just two pounds. He's carrying a little miniature teddy of his own and a basket with a few miniature things in there like a small teddy and a little robin I think that is. So if you have enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up, make sure you are subscribed to this channel and let me know what you think in the comments below. So that's it from me for now, I'll see you in the next video, take care of yourselves and bye for now.